the mentor mentee scheme is being implemented and every mentor is allocated some amount of mentees for the students so these mentors are continuously monitoring the performance of the mentees and help them in scoring high marks and also being placed Hello all this is Saisami Dean of Faculty of Science and Humanities SRMIST Kottangalathu SRMIST is a world famous university which has six faculties and one of this is Faculty of Science and Humanities which is having around 60 programs of undergraduate postgraduate and diploma programs and we have business studies related programs like bcom general bcom international accounting finance which is one of our flagship program where we have an industry partner and we also help our students to clear the acca exam gma exam for your information two of our students have cleared all 13 papers of acca at one stroke which is with the help of all our faculty members and we are also proudly say that we have become finance and taxation embedded with ca coaching it's coming up very well and uh, those who are aspiring to be an ad auditors and uh, clear the ca exam is most choiceable course of become and another most sought after course in this business studies is become computer applications where students who passed out in this has a lot of opportunity in fintech companies and we also have media related courses like bsc viscam they have good lab facilities and we also have ba journalism and mass communication and uh, most of our past out students are working in the media line either it is a print media or television media and our viscam students are easily getting jobs in film industry as well as the advertisement industries all those things and another our most sought of the programs are bc and mc you all know that data science is a vital discipline in the development of any nation so we have bc data science and mca generative ai and we also have bsc computer science with cyber security as a specialization aml as a specialization and we have msc full stack development and we have lot of computer related programs which is coming up very well and most of our students are easily placed after having gained the skill as well as the computer knowledge through this process of teaching learning and one good thing here we have is some of the courses like bsc psychology and msc counseling psychology and this helps a lot of our students to become the counselors to look into this uh, mental well being problems and also we have initiated and started the programs like psc defense and strategic studies and msc disaster management and not much of the colleges are having these kind of courses and for your kind information every department is having the you know is a research department and they are offering the phd courses also and one unique thing here which i want to share with you is 13 serving army officers are doing phd under the department of defense and strategic studies and we also have the tie up with the officers training academy chennai and the defense service top college wellington and offering them the courses like diploma in counseling psychology diploma in financial management diploma in cyber security by way by that way we are serving to the officers who are serving the nations and we also have the programs like fashion designing where A lot of our uh, students become entrepreneur even while they are studying. They have good artistic skill, and they have a lot of 
designing skill and some of our students are working behind the scene of so many popular programs like a lot of programs like big bus and so many other well known programs so in faculty of science and humanities we have 25 departments and as of today there are around 7500 students are studying in this faculty of science and humanities katangalathu 230 faculty members are there one notable thing here is that 90% of our faculty members are doctorates phd holders so they are all doing a lot of research work and it will be very useful for them to discuss the research related issues in the undergraduate classes as well as the postgraduate classes and we have the department of biotechnology and department of biochemistry and we can proudly say that two of our faculty members from biotechnology has been placed under the world top 2 percentage of scientist list and a lot of publications are from these departments involving the students operation and we also have bsc economics under faculty of science and humanities this is first of its kind in tamil nadu and this is not giving the conventional type of just understanding economics the curriculum is developed in such a way that it is a mix up of basic economic theory mathematical courses and the computer courses so that the students are highly employable and they can easily analyze the issues related to a company or the national importance and similarly we do have the literature department where we offer a ba english literature and ma english literature and students are uh, developing capabilities of uh, writing books and understanding the literature of various countries in the world and which is also one of the good thing which is happening in the faculty of science and humanities srmis and another thing is under fsh we have the department of sports and so all our students can also think of spending a good time in the sports and recently one of our bcom student had become the grand master in chess in india we are associated with uh, a lot of national important organizations and institutes for example we have semoli tamil aiv nirvanam which is doing a lot of work of promoting tamil throughout the world and we have an mou with them and we create content and those content are being telecast in the e vidya channel which has been inaugurated by our prime minister where tamil is being taught through english and hindi so that it reaches to the masses of india as well as the other countries and our students from this camp and our students from the computer science computer application department are working with this creation of this content and they act as an actors and they create content create contents and they take the videos and they edit all those things all those experiences they are gaining with this mou between that institute and the fsh srm ist kata and another thing is that apart from our classroom teaching learning process we spend a lot of money on lab related work for example we have a lot of data sources and which is being highly used by our students and we also had a tie up with coursera and so a lot of our faculty members and students they can join in their course and they complete and it will be useful for them to increase their teaching capability and for the students it is it increases the learning outcome and for example if a course consists of five units maybe one or two units we will map with the coursera course so students can have an experience of listening different lectures created by the various experts throughout the world and another striking difference between other institute and our institute is more than 60 percentage of our faculty members are trained mentors we have given training for them to clear that certificate program of mentors so that with the help of those mentors the mentor mentee 
scheme is being implemented and every mentor is allocated some amount of mentees that is students so these mentors are continuously monitoring the performance of the mentees and help them in scoring high marks and also being placed and these are not the unique features of FSH SRMIST and every department has a lot of club activities they have specific clubs like theater club culture club sports club and so many clubs are there students who have the talents a specific talents can exhibit those talents through those clubs so every week we'll have the programs either of academic or cultural and where these students gain the organizational capabilities leadership capabilities and sharing responsibilities to achieve the target of those things these are all the unique and good practices of faculty of science and humanities srmist kota group and any student who join in fsh srmist kota group will have a bright future with highly skilled in their own discipline and having potential knowledge in that discipline faculty of science and humanities has the department of sports where bsc physical education and msc yoga is being offered and it's a good opportunity for all of our students to spend quality time in the sports field and in fact recently one of our bcom student has become the grandmaster in chess which is a proud moment for all of us and fsh ktr is very keen on restructuring our curriculum and syllabus quite often in fact once in a 3 years we revised our curriculum as well as the syllabus and in the recent restructuring based on our national education policy we have introduced a path breaking structural composition of major minor and multidisciplinary which means a student who is joining in a particular major can choose to learn to earn a minor in around 18 departments he can choose one composition of 6 to 8 courses from any one of these 18 departments for example a student who is doing bcom may need some skill in computer so he can choose minor in computer science where he will do 6 or 8 courses to earn the minor in data science similarly a student who is doing a viscom may want to have a knowledge in business so he can choose a minor in commerce and also we offer three multidisciplinary courses from each department a student who wants to spend quality time in photography can think of taking a multidisciplinary course and photograph or film critics or a film study or a specific software package like r or python i just wanted to know the basics of psychology so these three multidisciplinary courses can be chosen by any student from any of the departments which will help them to fulfill their expectation from different field and increase the employable opportunity in the world so a student who join in fsh can go with a major degree and a minor degree along with three multidisciplinary skill course a student can earn bsc computer science with minor in economics or a student can earn bca with minor in english literature this is really a path breaking one which most of the higher education institutions do not have and another thing i wanted to share here is that students are encouraged to be part of the research and they are encouraged to take research issues and especially the department of social work and every week two days they must be in their field understand the problem of the neighborhood community and give them the solutions with all possible sources in fsh for example when our team visited a small village where the school children were needed a support from our faculty to learn 
spoken english and also a little bit of computer knowledge so when the team from social work approached the department of english and department of computer science immediately we form a team and we spent a week time with those kids and we imparted knowledge on the basic english and the computer knowledge which is welcoming one from both sides our students understand the real need and uh, the school students got benefit into that so fsh is not only concentrating on the discipline they choose we are aiming for the overall development they must understand how to cope up with the challenges and how to allocate their time qualitatively and how be as a team player so the overall personality development growth is the motto of fsh ktr and any student who join here can go out of this fsh fully fit to be a good personality in the society fsh ktr looking for you to build the nation thank you